Hello guys and welcome to another Premiere Pro tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how to create the CRT effect in Premiere Pro. So I've already imported my video clip onto my timeline over here. The first thing I'm going to do is to move over to my video effects and add the grid effect onto my video over here. Now I'm going to go over to my first control and on that grid I'm going to change the value of X anchor to minus 5 and change the size from to width and height and I'm going to increase my width until I can no longer see these vertical lines and change the height to 3, change my borders to 3 change the color from white to black and change the blending mode to overlay now move back to the effects library and add the lens distortion effect and I'll change my curvature to 50 and my vertical centering to 10 my horizontal decentering to 3 my vertical prism to 10 and my horizontal prism to 3 then I'll go over to motion at the top over here and increase the scale and the position till I've completely filled up this screen move back to the effects library and search for the noise effect and under noise and green you find the noise effect add it onto your clip and set the amount of noise to 10 and make sure that you have selected your use color noise the next thing i'm going to do is to move over to the lumetri color tab and under the basic correction i'm going to increase my exposure to somewhere around 1.7 or 2 and i'm going to increase my contrast 27.3 looks fine to me i'm going to increase my highlights to 40 i'm going to increase the whites 30.09 looks fine to me now I'm going to select the creative tab over here and reduce the vibrance a little bit. I move down to my shadow tint here and increase the red value a little bit. Now I move over to the highlight over here and increase the blue a little bit. I move back to the effects and search for the channel blur effect. And add this channel blur effect onto my clip over here. I move back to the effects control over here and set the red blurriness to 50 and the blur dimension I'm going to set to horizontal and move back to my effects library and search for the strobe light effect and add this effect onto my clip move back to the effects control panel over here and leave the strobe color to white I'm going to set the blend with original to 95 and change the strobe duration to 1 I'll leave the strobe period as 1 and change the random strobe probability to somewhere around 35% and change the strobe operator to add and change the random speed to 5. And that's it guys on how to create this CRT effect in Premiere Pro. Now instead of going through this process every time we want to create this effect, what you can do is to select every single one of these effects by holding down the control key and selecting every single one of these effects, right click and select save preset. I'm going to rename this to CRT effect and hit OK. And if I go over to my preset over here and bring it down, you can see the CRT effect that we have created over here. And now we can easily add it to a new clip by dragging this effect onto this new clip. And all you have to do is just to increase the scale and the position value. And that's it guys on how to create this CRT effect. I hope you found this tutorial very useful. If you did, kindly give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you and see you guys in my next video tomorrow.